Hello fishy folks, happy Sunday fun day. Today, an update video of the planted angel tank. This is a 55 gallon aquarium running off a uh, box filter and a sponge filter. It used to be two sponge filters, but I'm switching over to box filters so I can use the sponge filters outside of my ponds. You can see here in the corner I have a ginormous uh, sword plant I got at the BCAS auction. I also got that littler one that's over there. Uh, there are some other assorted plants in the front. You plant people can tell me what they are. Uh, this over here is dwarf sedge, I know. And I forgot the rest. The inhabitants of this tank are four angelfish, one marble, one I don't know what that is. Daniel Anderson sent it to me as a little dime-sized fry, as he sent that silver. And then, people call that a koi, but I'm pretty sure that's just a gold pearl scale or gold scale. Uh, I actually got that angelfish at Petco, and he's a bully. I've considered him, I've considered actually selling him because he's a bully. He, uh... I had a little black uh, angelfish in here, and he killed it. Um, and he's been picking on that other marble in the corner for quite some time now. Also, there's Liam the lemon pleco back there, and then there's two clown plecos or rubble, sorry, rubber lip plecos in here as well. Uh, I have an old school fluval heater in here, and that's it. Um, oh, there's some. Uh, dwarf lilies that recently I cut back they were I don't know all the lilies were covering the top of the water and there's another little uh, sword you can see some of the outer leaves dying off and it's growing quite nice as people told me it would be growing after I uh, kind of move some stuff around in the tank so this tank, uh, there was uh, some additional driftwood in this tank. I've taken it out and used it downstairs in some of my Pleco breeding tanks. Driftwood's pretty expensive and uh, I figured, what the heck. So uh, you can see some green beans. I fed Liam some green beans this morning. Uh, there's about 10 in there. Now there's probably, oh, the angels are eating them too. Now maybe not 10, maybe five. There's Liam. I got Liam when he was about uh, an inch long, maybe an inch and a half long, and that's about as full grown as he's going to get, I think. Um, some people say he doesn't look like a lemon pleco. That's what he was sold to me as, and that's what I'm going with. So, folks, I do need some help. Uh, I do need to figure out how and what these plants are on the front, uh, how to plant them so they grow, and uh, just want to make sure though that... The issue with those leaves are just die off from uh, replanting them. I got them about two or three weeks ago after the auction. Uh, this ginormous one over here had babies. I took about 10 or 12 babies from it yesterday, as a matter of fact. Um, and I'm just floating them downstairs in one of my tanks for now. Not sure what I'm going to do with them, if I'm going to sell them or replant them somewhere. Um, so the help I need, what are those down there? <laughs> All of them. So we'll call this one. That's Java Fern. That's two. And it's kind of floating with its roots, roots uh, going into the substrate. I'm pretty sure that's okay. And uh, tell me about my plants. Is that just die off or do I have deficiencies? And same thing here. There's some, some holes, some brown holes in the leaves and some tips that are missing. Uh, I didn't put any root tabs in yet, um, just because I wanted the roots to, to uh, I want to make sure I liked where I had the plants for now. The idea was, for me, visually, was to have something big over here covering our filter, something big over here covering our filter, and then swimming room in the middle for the guy. So, well, that big pleco just ate a green bean, look. Not, that's not a pleco, that's an angelfish. That big angelfish just ate a green bean. All right, fishy folks, let me know in the comments below what you think, uh, how I can help it, what do you think it looks like, and uh, anything else you want to tell me about the tank. Have a good Sunday fun day, everyone.